Well, the man who killed five people at a house party in Calgary will soon start reintegrating into the community. Matthew de Groot stabbed the victims while he was in a psychotic state four years ago. The Alberta Review Board says he will be transferred to Edmonton and may start taking escorted trips out. Megan Grant has that story. The board has ordered that Matthew DeGru be moved to the Alberta Hospital in Edmonton. There, if his treatment team approves, he will be allowed out into the community as long as he's supervised by a responsible adult. And he could even be placed in a halfway house under 24-hour supervision. In April 2014, at a party celebrating the end of university classes, Matthew DeGru fatally stabbed five young people. Zachariah Rathwell, Lawrence Hong, Joshua Hunter, Caitlin Paris, and Jordan Segura. Originally charged with five counts of first-degree murder, DeGrood was found not criminally responsible after a two-week trial in May 2016. The judge ruled he was in a psychotic state at the time of the killing, suffering schizophrenia symptoms, and could not understand that his actions were morally wrong. Now, every year, DeGrood's victims' families must attend annual reviews, which are like a progress report on his treatment and risk to reoffend. In September, members of the now 27-year-old's treatment team called him a model patient and said his schizophrenia is in full remission. The victim's families have said over and over again they do not want DeGrood granted freedoms and especially do not want to see him back in the community. One of the reasons DeGrood will be moved to Edmonton is that the board wants to set him up for successful reintegration into the community. The board found that here in Calgary, he may encounter a toxic environment. Megan Grant, CBC News, Calgary.